Hello, welcome to Easy Company Collect. Welcome to Easy Company Collect Balls, and today we're looking at the Patrol Trooper, as you can see, without all the plastic. So today we're looking at the Hot Toys 1-6 scale, man, it's been a while since I've done a review. 1-6 scale Hot Toys Patrol Trooper from Han Solo, no, wait, Solo, the Star Wars story movie. As you can see, it's still in the plastic, just got it from Sideshow. Let me get a knife so I can cut this bitch open. And, um, I haven't even opened anything yet, so you're going to be uh, seeing this with me. So let's just jump right in. So, of course, the thing retails at, like, uh, 220 I think it was, which isn't bad. Um, being that it's Troopers, you're not going to get, um... See up front so there he is right there um the exposure is high i'll lower it later um it comes with a bunch of hands as you can see here i'm not going to get out all the hands because it's your typical like your hands open palm hands fists and baton grabbing hands and stuff like that um so it's it's a pretty it's basic stuff right there and then you have a scout pistol right there which is it's a it's a scout pistol i think I'm not sure what it, there is a certain name for it of course but i don't know it of course you're not a fan easy you don't like star wars you don't know names you're not a true fan now one of the things i liked about this figure is that it, it stuck to its roots <clears throat> oh, right through a plastic and it kept the uh rectangular base i love that rectangular base it, it fits nice and that thing is fancy uh, guys, that thing is fancy, that, that plaque. So uh, we're going to go through this stuff. And that's all it comes with. It's pretty basic as far as what it comes with. Uh, you're, you're not going to get much with this guy at 220 I think the retail was. Um, but um, like I said, uh, BigBadToyStore.com. Make sure you check them out. Make sure you shop with them. Um, really good store to shop with. They have a pile of loot system going on. So you can pile up a ton of figures and have it all shipped for 4 bucks. 
which is freaking awesome. And I really like the way they sell stuff. Let's get behind the figure.
a short tripper or something like that with like m mostly soft goods and it is armored so you, you these pieces are held on with elastics and this one i want to know what this is held on with i, I kind of want to pull it i, I don't want to break it it looks like it's held on like with straps and stuff underneath so that's that's good right here that you can get really good articulation out of them oh my god that wash it's whitewashing him I'm sorry but then I'm black washing it too I'll get a new system I'll get a new setup um, and then you have limited ab crunch because of his armor um, he does have ab crunch but it is limited um, as you can see his his articulation on arms is really nice whoa there's no turn on this torso there's no articulation i don't know what why why would that happen is it me or is it tight oh shit! what was that something snapped see this is why i don't really like doing articulation on on cameras or on on, on reviews and on camera it's kind of like I kill the figure before I even get to mess with it myself. But, uh, see, these come out pretty good. So they're good for our shoulder. Whoa! Why is it making sounds? But it's good for.
hard to come by in design. They don't really risk it too much in the new films. They just kind of go all out with stupid shit instead of like experimenting and, and keeping old design and stuff like that. So, good old figure. If you like what you saw here, these company collectibles. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share to the video. And Facebook group coming up, Easy uh, Paradox Collector Group. Me and Paradox Nerd coming up with a little collector group of our own. So stay tuned and uh, bye.